well, I'm encouraging people to be selfish. I'm encouraging people not to be self-centered, but to be selfish in that they are a priority. And so self-care isn't getting a manicure per se, it can be, but it would be noticing that your body is your one home that you're gonna have and how you're gonna take care of it. Or sometimes self-care is practicing non-judgmental talk to yourself or practicing self-talk in a positive way, having conversations with yourself that are positive. So self-care comes in a lot of different ways. Self-care comes in taking care of your mental health, taking care of your physical health, taking care of your relationship with yourself, taking care of healthy reciprocal relationships around you. It does not mean codependence or attacking yourself or negative self-talk. So that's why I talk about self-care and if someone interprets self-care as selfish, then I'm saying, please be selfish. Please be selfish in that way that just takes you to a place of resilience and restoration and a place where you can recognize that your trauma gave you an opportunity to transform, resurrect, and create meaning out of life.